on the official television station of Illini Sports. This is WCIA 3 Sports and your Illini Nation. Illinois finally beat Indiana on the road in 2021 for the first time in a decade. The difference was there weren't any fans. Not the case today as the 18th ranked Illini put first place in the Big Ten of the line against the Hoosiers in one of the loudest places in college basketball, Assembly Hall. Luke Goody gets Illinois started with a three off the bench, but Indiana leading early. Andre Curbelo with the steal here, but ends up getting tripped. No call. Goody, though, whistled for the intentional foul on the play. Brian Underwood almost gets a tech arguing with the refs, and so does Curbelo. Sets the tone the rest of the way. Tamar Bates then, pull up for the Hoosiers, gets it to go. 7 nothing Hoosiers run as they take back the lead from Illinois. But Trent Frazier came to play in this one. Crafty play here, breaking some ankles. Gets this one just inside the three-point line to tie the game back up at 28. But I use Race Thompson. A little put back there on the floater. He leads the Hoosiers with 13 at the half. Indiana up by two at that point. Trace Jackson Davis getting the Hoosiers out to a good start in the second. Layup there after only four minutes of playtime in the first. He had just six points in the game, but Illinois fighting back. Jacob Grandison back-to-back -back threes gives Illinois its first lead since 4-2. to two. Grandison feeling himself with the mind control barstool. Carl loving him some orange and blue as well. And Kofi Coburn getting into the action again. We haven't seen him much in the first half. Gets the and one to go. There he finishes with 17 points and eight rebounds. Then Trent Frazier. Goes for three two times in a row. Timeout Hoosiers and Illinois feeling themselves. Curbelo feeling the dance here as well as Illinois gets a double digit victory. A huge second half propels them to a 74 57 win. Frazier had 14 just in the second half. Coburn had 15 in the second half. Zibane nearly double up the Hoosiers after the break. WCIA 3 Sports Director Brett Behrens has more on the big win from Bloomington. From down two at half to holding the Hoosiers to 21 in the final 20 minutes. There's a tale of two halves, and then there's this game where Illinois dominated down the stretch. Trent Frazier and Kofi Coburn combined to score 26 points in the second half. That's more than Indiana had as a team as the Illini held the Hoosiers to their worst shooting percentage of the season at 35% for the game. And that's what the Illini wanted to talk about afterwards. A lot of teams focus on offense. Um, our main focus is defense, you know, and we take such pride in that. Whenever we have a good uh, defensive game, we celebrate those, you know. To hold a team like that to 21 points, a really good offensive team like that, um, it's tremendous. Defensively, that's what we try to bring every night, you know. Uh, we try to rebound our behinds off, um, bring a lot of effort, and just, you know, defend. And, you know, that's what we did tonight in the second half. Illinois head coach Brad Underwood said he challenged his team to stop fouling at halftime. The change worked, and the offense followed as the Illini closed the game on a 32-11 to run in the final 13 minutes. I was really pleased at half to be only down two. I thought we withstood their energy, their emotion. But I thought the second half, um, our defense was terrific. We held the team to 21 points. I thought our offense allowed our defense to be great simply because we kept him out of transition. The 17-point win here at Indiana, the largest margin of victory for Illinois at Indiana since 1956, and more history for the Orange and Blue, who have now won 13 out of their last 15 Big Ten road games. Reporting in Bloomington, Indiana, for your Illini Nation, Brett Barron's WCIA 3 Sports. Thanks, Brett. For more on the win, including Brad Underwood's full post-game press conference and the WCIA 3-in-1 podcast, you can go to WCIA.com.